And good morning, everybody. I am so excited to be able to start day two of my new life with full-time chalking with Mimi's Chalking Madness. And I am up, dressed, and I'm ready to go rock this thing. I'm going to go visit some places and see about setting up some pop-up shops. And uh, I'm ready to rock and roll with this thing. So anyway, y'all say a prayer for me today. And um, hope everything goes well. So anyway... I guess kind of my thought for today is, you know, um, me and my hubby are in a little bit of a struggle right now, um, not being on the same page about my new life change uh, with losing my job yesterday, my daytime job. But you know what? I trust God because I know in my heart that this is 100% where I'm supposed to be and what I'm supposed to be doing, and I can't wait to see uh, how this business grows and the great journey that it's going to take me on to get there and the amazing people that I get to meet along the way. But you know, the men, they worry about the things that they're supposed to worry about, which is finances and insurance and all that kind of stuff. And so this is a little bit of a life change event, but I am not going to stress about it because I know that it is all going to be okay. I have like no wavering doubt whatsoever about the direction that I'm in right now. So anyway, say a prayer that we can get on the same page because I do not like having struggles in my life, especially whenever they can be um, prevented. Um, I think he's coming around. He understands where my heart is and where um, my uh, passion is with this business. But at the same time, you know, he's got to worry about the things that he worries about. But anyway, um, you know what? I, I just... I refuse to let somebody stand in my way of making this dream happen and if you have goals in your life don't let people stand in your way and telling you that you can't do it and be positive you, you know about where you want to go in the direction that you want to go in you know I'm not saying be like rebellious woman or whatever you know but um, go for it you know because you're going to later in life you're going to be looking back and you're going to be like oh my god i wish i would i wish i would you know or you see somebody else that made a success in a business that you second guessed yourself doing and so by you second guessing you just kind of decided well you took the way easy way and decided to not do it and then later you're going to be like oh my god if i'd have stayed in it at that time i could be where she is you know there's a lot of people that i met at uh leadership and stuff and this is like okay they've been in this for a year and a half you know and look at where they are and i can do that same thing so i talk a lot about mindset because i do believe that our mindset has an awful lot to do with the directions that we go in our life and letting self-doubt come into this little brain of mine is not a good thing because I, re I, I just refuse to go there and I'm not going to let naysayers be all up in my ears either because in a way it's kind of good because it just drives me that much more just to show them that I can do what I set my mind to do. So women, you look, look, if there is a change that you want in your life, you know, take the steps to make that change because it is your life and your story and you're going to have to write it. And so what do you want your story to be? This is a little bit of a scary time right now because this happened. But at the same time, I prayed for God to help me because I was conflicted in what I know in my heart I want to do because I see the goal and the vision and what I could do if I was able to work this business full time. And then totally not into the job that I was at anymore. You know, my heart was not there, and there's, so therefore my work performance was probably lacking. No, not probably. It was. It was lacking. So, anyway, um, I just, God answered that prayer, you know, because I'm like, <laughs> I got fired. I mean, hello, how more, there it is, you know, so I don't have a job, you know, so this, now, it really drives me because now I have to make an income doing this. So, yes, it's scary in a way, but then at the same time, I'm just so, like, giddy inside that this happened, and I can't wait, you know, to get this thing going. And so, um, I just want to encourage you, you know, that if you've got something in you that you've kind of been wanting to do and you, you're scared, let me tell you, girlfriend, you're not going to figure it out, and you're not going to know unless you do it. But if you're going to commit to something, commit to it 100%. 
pour everything you have into it so that you can be successful in doing what you set out to do for yourself because I just really want to be able to have an amazing life um, in the future forever how many more years that is and I really wish that I'd had this opportunity back in my 30s you know but hello I'm almost double that age now but that's okay because this is a great time to do this you know I don't have kids at home and all that kind of stuff and this is just this is wonderful and it's bringing out so many different things in me it's taking me outside those comfort zones and just letting me learn how to just be something I didn't know I could be and I am just loving it you know so anyway if there's anything I can help you with give you an encouraging word motivate you um, whatever I need to do to help you on your way hey comment below send me a private message hook me up as your friend and we'll just travel this little life journey together and um i just i thank all of those uh supporters that i do have in my life uh my chalk sisters that i have met and uh some of them i've only known on facebook but i at leadership i got the chance to meet some amazing women that are now in my circle of friends and i am so thankful for all of their love and support and encouragement and just telling me that i can do this because with all that behind me how can i mess it up you know what i'm saying so anyway i just want to leave you a little tidbit today about because i'm fixing to get this thing rocking and rolling so i just want you to know go for what you want for yourself because you don't want to go back later in life and say oh i wish i could have i wish i could have i wish i could have i wish i would have you know i wanted to live on the beach i wanted to live by a lake well you know what i do want a beach life and so this is going to get me there because I'm determined to have that in my future. So you know what? I love all y'all. I appreciate y'all following me and listening to my little um, videos and um, supporting me. So please like and share and comment below. Go to my website at chocotour.com, Mimi's Madness. Look at all the good things we have in our catalog. Place you in order. We also have a new program, a monthly club couture, where you get exclusive transfers mailed to your house with three sample packs. No shipping. Happy mail once a month for $19.99. You cannot beat that. It is awesome. So, you're interested in that? Leave me a message. Leave me a little comment down there. And, um... I'll make it happen for you. So anyway, y'all have a very blessed day. And I'm going to come back on here later and let y'all know how my day went. So anyway, have a blessed day. And as I always say, I'm going to catch all of you on the flip side.